Greetings AG2. Today's topic is data store. And basically what I want to demonstrate to you today is just how to build a basic standard name line query in data store. Once you have mastered that task, you can begin adding fields that you like and customizing queries to meet your requirements. So once you get inside of data store, you want to click the plus sign next to AHRS data store query wizard and soldier core is where you, you want to start with the basics of fields that you need first field we want to use is military personnel class you can get the code or the description the description spells it out the code is all we need however so I've got the MPC next I want to add the soldiers rank abbreviation is what you want you'll get sergeant as SGT if you choose current rank code you'll get T5 R5 etc so we want the abbreviation next I want to add the name and name reporting format gives me the full name you can select individual names last name first name middle name suffix you can separate them like that it's up to you, personal preference. Next, I want to add the SSN. And then the home UIC code. So this will give us the UIC and it will give us the name of that UIC, the battalion name or company name. Next, let's add a duty status. And if you don't know what the duty status codes are, if you put the description, it will put it in plain English for you. And finally, you want to come down to current assignment attachment data. And this field here, event type code, you want to add that to your query so if you right click here you can add a filter I'm gonna add a filter for a specific company that I want you can wait for it to list all the values for you or you can type in the values I'm gonna simply type in the value whiskey kilo 0101 is the company that I want hit OK now we're filtering for I've got one filter whiskey kilo 0101 and I also want to filter on event type code I recommend you add that to every query you run I'm gonna select assigned ASGN if you don't select assigned or attached then what you get is if I'm attached to Bravo company assigned to HHC you're gonna get my name twice so I will show up two times one as assigned to HHC one is attached to Bravo company so again if you don't do that you will get a duplicate for individuals who are attached but if you do this you will get only the assigned record for each individual so I'm applying my filters Let's run it. And as you can see, I have the data that I've requested. I can click name reporting format. I can sort it A to Z. You can change the field names if you don't want that data store name. You can change it to MPC. I recommend you leave them but if it's a custom query that you need for something else then you can customize the field names or the field columns in 
that UIC HHC 1st Brigade 4th Infantry Division again that was data store basics stay tuned for more AG2 thank you